Baby glass eels, or elvers, that are caught in Maine are selling for record prices, and they're bringing high prices. Uh, uh, it's been so successful that the state is reaching its quota and may cut the season two months short. New Center Maine's Jack Mulma dives into what fishermen are calling one of the best years for eel fishing. I think it hit everybody by surprise. It may not be one of the largest fishing industries in Maine, but pound for pound, it rakes in a lot more money, reeling in almost 20 million a year. They're swimming pretty nicely at the moment. A big price to pay for a small fish. Elvers, also known as baby eels, are caught right here in Maine by the hundreds of thousands. Then they are shipped to Japan and China, where they will be raised for food. A few years ago, elver fishing exploded, with fishermen getting more than $2,300 per pound. Then the pandemic hit. In 2020, it went down to $525. But elvers have bounced back, and fishermen are now getting nearly $2,200 a pound. The high prices of these elvers makes the industry more valuable to the state. This helps fishermen, this helps their families, this helps all of the persons uh, that supply them and it, it helps everyone in the state of Maine. That's John Carey, who together with his son, run international seafood harvesting in Portland. They've been dealing elvers for eight years. There's a plethora of fish. Uh, people are harvesting them sooner. While the season has been good, research tells us that nothing is guaranteed. A lot of what happens in your net depends on what happens out in the ocean. Jason Bartlett is in the middle of a 17-year study looking at the lifespan of eels and says there are just too many factors to accurately predict how each year will go. It, it varies from year to year. It's really hard to, to even predict what will happen next year. But with the season coming to an early close, the carries will make their final stops along the main coast, buying whatever harvesters will sell them. The key, the foundation to this uh, are the fishermen, and they're doing very well. In Portland, Jack Molmud, News Center, Maine. State officials tell us that prices for elvers will continue to rise as the season winds down and could even break the record price of more than $2,300 per pound.